All right, so let's talk about how well we did with our dollar store roundup here. I guess I'll start from left and go to the right. One of the first things we picked up is our laundry hamper. Uh, this thing is super small. And when I saw the picture of it, I totally pictured uh, crawdads hanging off the side of the boat, using them as live bait or uh, shrimp if you're fishing saltwater, something like that. Hang it from uh, right here. Maybe hang it over the edge of the boat. Get on in there, get your bait, let it go. A dollar. Big heavy gloves just in case you got to run off to a wedding or something like that. You don't have time to clean up. You still got to clean your fish. LED press light. Put that inside the cargo compartment underneath so that uh, you know you can see what you're getting at. Velcro, number of uses. Hand sanitizer, pretty self explanatory. You're out on the boat, you uh, just got mess all over your hands and you want to eat. No big deal. Uh, another pair of uh, dedicated pliers, that way you're not stealing pliers from the kitchen every time you want to go fishing. Uh, chamois cloth, use it to wipe your hands off. Uh, if it's hot, you know, you can uh, get some water on it, put it on your neck, it'll cool you down. And uh, I got a small one and then a really, really big one back here. These uh, initially spoke to me as leashes, um, but I noticed that they were bug repellent, so you can sort of hang them all around your kayak and they should keep the mosquitoes away from you. These are the four finger lights that I talked about. They come with little straps so you can clip them onto the tips of your rods, turn them on, they glow. You'll know when you're getting a strike at night. This is uh, cheap and kind of cheesy, um, but it's a dog leash. You connect it right here to your, uh, your little uh, bungee cord that you got running back and forth and take the other end and make your little hitch there connect that onto your rod or your reel and uh, now you're leashed up and good to go zip ties uh, no need to explain there especially if you have a crate you want to make something on the go you want to repair something you're good to go everybody needs one of these this is a sunglasses retainer that goes behind your neck so that if you drop your sunglasses they'll just sit right in front of you you're not losing them this obviously big old cooler bag flexible soft you can fold it up put it away um, put your fish in here with some ice they'll stay cold basically it's a poor man's alternative to a fish bag and last but not least a car wash sponge this does a very very good job of soaking up little bits of water that uh, end up laying around in the boat especially after a rainstorm or something like that uh, it also does really well if you need to get some water that's down in your hatch stick it on down in there pull the water out and there you go. Every single one of those things was a dollar. I think maybe we're up to about 20 bucks or 25 bucks for just about everything you're going to need kayak fishing. So, hope you like it.